Cursive with Bridget Perry and Lisa Clemens, Coach Logan with statement. Yeah, our turnovers in the second half is what got us. Uh, when April went out with the concussion at the 16-minute mark, obviously we, we had to play a lot of young players and uh, um, that type of pressure. You know, one will learn from it, but um, obviously um, you can't have as many turnovers, 20, 20 turnovers when we didn't do that in the first half. So um, our depth was very, very shallow tonight, so you couldn't make a lot of errors. Um, thought we had it in the regulation, had a good play set up. Um, you know, we played good defense, got that, and then had an opportunity to win it, and then uh, overtime they just took over. Where you guys are so used to having April in there? What, what changes when she's not out there? Um, April's a leader for us in the court. She calms everything down, she handles pressure very well, um, and she gets us all under control. And when she's in the game, turnovers like that don't happen. You know, she directs us. So when our point guard's out, an experienced point guard, it's very tough to play without her. But regardless, when one of us goes down, no matter who it is, we have to step up. Is it just, uh, I guess, just the mindset down there? Been close in a lot of these games. Just what will it take to get over, get over that hump? Um, everybody just pulling through and fighting through uh, till the end. Um, we had some bad turnovers at the end, which really killed us. So uh, we just, we definitely just have to come together, get everybody's mindset on the right, on the right track, and we just gotta fight. I guess a similar question, Bridget. You guys have lost big four of these games in overtime at home, which is, you know, a little bit d difficult, I would imagine. Does looking at what's that been like to have those opportunities slip by? Um, it's heartbreaking, you know, when you lose a close game like that and you fight for over 40 minutes, for 45 minutes, and you let it go because of, it's us who give it away, we make the turnovers, it's controllable. So I think we just need to continue to learn from it. In these crucial times, we can't keep fouling, can't like, make those turnovers in the end of the game, so, you know, we have to pull through. Sure. Just Overall, did you feel like you did a better job attacking offensively from start to finish? I thought we were, did everything fine. You know, we shot better, we did everything better, and our mindset was great, and our mindset will continue to be great. You know, um, you know, we can control some things. You can control free throws. You can control turnovers to some degree. Um, you know, so <coughs> those are the things that are controllable, and we had a good mindset. So, you know, um, we'll continue to have the same mindset. And, if the team's better than us, great. But if they're not, you know, we have got to continue to grow and learn from it. Sharon, what did you want on the last possession before we got called for the moving screen? And did you feel like you got into the play quickly enough? I don't think Ashley started moving until it was about five seconds or so. No, she moved at seven seconds. It was supposed to come off the screen at six. So she did exactly what I wanted to. It was just going to be a pick and pop. It was Ashley's going to shoot or she's going to give it to Whitney for a shot. We're not going to give them any time to go down and score at all. Lisa, the, the last couple minutes of the first half, I know you got the, the bucket right at the end by Green gave you a little boost, but did you feel like you know those those two or three minutes you guys you could have kept a, a double figure lead it, it might have helped you out going into halftime? Um I think that definitely helped uh Bree, Bree shot, it gave us a boost. Um and what we needed to do was just learn off of that and play off of that. Uh we came out in the second half and it wasn't good, but the way we finished our first half, it should have boosted us for the second. Thanks, guys.